What's up painting friends? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Stoof and today I'm excited to do a product review and unboxing of a multifunction master easel. It's an H easel. It holds two paintings and it's portable. It has wheels on it. It's collapsible. This looks like an incredible easel. Viswin is the company that produces this easel and they reached out to me uh, asking if I would try out their product and create a review for you guys. So that is what I'm here to do. It looks like it's made very well and it looks like it's very functional for artists that are working on multiple pieces or a large piece. So this looks like a great easel for me. Uh, I am... I've got the box right here. It is a large box, which is great because that means it's not in 10,000 pieces. <laughs> and it is solid beech wood for this easel. So I'm gonna get it out of the box here and then I'm going to build it and then we're gonna test it out. Easel comes in, the box is about 53 inches by 19 inches by four inches. So it has the components list, it has the easel pre-assembled section. So this is great. It comes with a little wrench and a uh, Phillips head screwdriver. So you don't even need to buy those to be able to assemble. Just did over there. So there's what the easel looks like after it's installed and before I add the wheels. And the last step is to add the wheels. And I think I'm not gonna add the wheels because I am not gonna be moving it around much. It's gonna stay in the same place in my art studio, uh, but I will keep the wheels and maybe use them sometime in the future if I take this easel with me for painting in my travel trailer when we go on our national park trips. All right guys, here is the easel after I installed it. It took me about 30 minutes to install and build the easel, which is not that bad. Uh, and I only messed up one time, so <laughs> the instructions are pretty clear as well. As you can see, it holds two paintings. 
Uh, these are paintings that I both completed a while ago. Uh, so what I want to do next is try out the easel uh, with different angles because it looks like we can do some adjustments to it. We'll adjust this one. Bring this down just by loosening it up. Oh, you know what? That one doesn't come down. That one's that one could. So what we can do is lift this up. And then this can come up. And let's put it up to like right here. And then this one can come up to the top of this section, which is like right here. And it locks in on your piece. It has uh, two different uh, latch sections here. There's one for um, panels and one for canvases. And then we can lift this guy up if we wanted to work on this one at height or eye level. Pretty good, and they pretty sturdy once you tie them down. And then we can also adjust the angle. If we want to work on something more in an angle like this, or straight up and down. in those and then I'm not sure where the oh look at this so if your paintings are done and you're you want to let them dry this is great you can just turn this into a drying table for your pieces and just let them sit here until they're totally dry and uh, then you can just tilt it right back down very cool and then you just tighten these up if you want it to stay. This is awesome. I've had easels that can go up and down and do one big piece, um, but I haven't had ones that tilt and I haven't had any uh, professional easels that can hold multiple paintings, so this is very nice. And this is a 24 by 36 inch painting here, so look, I can put this big painting up on the easel. And I'm totally going to be working on this one. Oh, this is great. All right, I'm definitely going to be using this easel to finish this painting because the easel I've been using for this painting is not the right easel. <laughs> this is the right easel for this painting. So this is great. Very nice. And um, let's see what else we got here. Like I mentioned before, this is solid beech wood. It is very well sanded. Uh, it's I don't feel any splintery pieces of wood. It's nice and smooth. Uh, these are really nice little uh, tightening pieces for you know tightening the easel so it doesn't move or for loosening it up so that you can make adjustments to the easel while painting here. I don't I don't feel like this thing's gonna fall down at all. Uh, the only thing I'm noticing is that the brackets at the bottom uh, are, are a little bit shaky. If you like really shake the easel, those little brackets at the bottom uh, aren't huge. So, I mean, don't throw yourself at your canvas and your <laughs> easel when you're working. As long as you're uh, using it for what it is meant for, you shouldn't have any problems. So. This is the Multifunctional Master Easel by Viswin. I give this an A plus with my first use. Setup was pretty simple and just uh, seeing how the easel works, I'm very impressed. So I'm planning to continue using this easel. I'm probably gonna start using this thing first thing tomorrow morning, working on this um, wedding painting. Uh, so I will leave a little bit of notes in the description under this video a few months from now with an update on how this easel is performing. But uh, first impression is A+, plus, great easel. Thank you Vizwin for sending me this. Uh, if you guys have any questions about this easel, leave a comment for me. I have a link for this easel in the description under this video.